just in a studio and I thought I was having to think, I'm waiting for a guest to turn up. Uh, and I thought, uh, I'd been pondering something. We talk about charities, I say we veterans, so we talk about charities and support that is there or some people say isn't there. And um, the difficulty in getting the right people, the right, the right support. Uh, sometimes, as I've experienced myself um, recently and longer term, you can all the support you can you can need or want for a person uh, who's in trouble uh, can be there, and it can be offered. And ultimately, it always boils down to a decision from the the person who needs to be the beneficiary, the person who's in who's in a bad way, and they the decision they need to make the decision to accept the support or ask for the support. Uh, and that, that's the reality. Uh, I I've, I've seen that in the past um, with my dad. Uh, when he was, uh, my dad's a recovering alcoholic now, and I, you won't mind me saying this, but he was in a position where he, 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 we'd done everything we could. I say we, me, his family, his friends, um, we'd done everything we could to try, and, oh, over years, to try and just talk sense into him, bring him round, and, and he did something he didn't want to do, uh, just the way it is. You know, it's a, it's, it's a, it's a, it's an illness, you know, alcoholism. And uh, when people, whatever it is, it's usually down to an illness, a mental or physical, you know, illness. Um, but there's always, there's always going to be a decision point and they have to accept the help or they have to ask for the help. And I'm in a, you know, a situation recently where um, there's a person and he's, in, he's not in a great way at all, at all. And there's support are available. Um, and he's not, uh, he's not accepting it. Uh, and he's not actively seeking it. But it is there. And it's been offered. Um, and the thing is with it is that as soon as you... That's not me laying blame. I'm not assigning blame. The problem is, is that the iller you become, the more difficult it becomes to make the right decision. And the more difficult it becomes to make logical and rational decisions. And the easier it becomes to shy away from addressing the issues. Uh, so again, I'm not laying blame. I'm trying to explain it. You know, sometimes all the support and all the help is there and it all comes down to the individual accepting it, acknowledging there's a problem or or swallowing that pride pill and asking for help or accepting help. It's just what it is sometimes. Um, and in those situations, it's incredibly frustrating and all you can do is someone as an onlooker, a friend or a family member of, the, of that person, you just got to repeatedly, repeatedly be there for them, repeatedly try and reinforce to them, accept the help, do something about it, do this, do that, you know, um, reduce the alcohol, reduce, I increase your activity, um, just start trying to think a bit more positive. And these are all really small things. Um, and I'm, I'm not explaining it very well, I don't think, but my point is all the help in the world can be there. Some people, they just don't want to accept it. They aren't well enough to accept it and they need a kick up the ass to get him over the line. Um, proverbial kick up the ass or nurturing to get him across the line. They can take a long time, a long time. It was the same for myself. It took me a long time to um, to go and ask for help. And it was through the persistence of other people badgering me for months and months and months and months and months and months. And eventually I did, you know, and you know, I could have had it sooner. I could have been in a lot better place than I was. And it was all down to me not wanting to go and get it. But again, the position I was in, it was a difficult decision for me. It was an easy decision for me not to do anything. <laughs> uh, a difficult decision to go and do something about it and acknowledge it was an issue. So, anyway, I thought I'd uh, gob off about that one. <laughs>